I mean, okay. Cat has existed since the beginning of time. Cat has seen all and knows all. Cat walked the planet amidst the dinosaurs, where all the other cavemen thought it was very cool. Cat ruled a great kingdom, where his many servants thought he was very cool. Cat fought a great war, and no, this is not the Battle of Chantilly, this is the Great War was given a medal for being the coolest guy on the battlefield. After the war, Cat decided that maybe it was time he settled down with a nice girl, maybe have some kids. But Cat was cursed by eternity. It seemed as though his time with his wife and kids ended in the blink of an eye. Cat grieved for them, but over the years, he moved on. Cat lived on into the future, and he even got a sick hoverboard like, look at that thing. That's so cool. Like, all we have are those stupid segways without the handles. Like, they're not, they're not even hovering. They're just on two wheels. It's like a scooter that moves sideways. It's like, it's like a ripstick without all the wiggling. They're so stupid. I hate them. Why do they exist? Like, anyway. Cat continued to exist through the rest of time. He watched humanity all the way to its end. And eventually, the world's end. Cat moved on to space where he found life outside of Earth, and that's kind of badass. Cat found many things all the way to the end of time, and as all things ceased to exist, Cat became bored. Cat was not the boring one, Cat simply had nothing left around him. Cat's pretty cool, actually. He's he's not he's not boring. Cat Cat was never really boring. You just didn't know the whole story. Like, come on, come on. You gotta you gotta look into Cat a little more before you just assume that he's boring. Like that's kind of rude. I can't believe you just assume that about him. That's just kind of messed up.